So I am back today with a haul and it's from a website called rosegal.com which does like a lot of really reasonably priced clothing and stuff and it's been a really long time since I've done a haul with a website like this and is it just me or are they like really stepped up their game? I was looking through and there were so many cute things that were like really goth appropriate and the sizing seems to have got a lot better as well because before like a lot, well I don't know with Rose Gal, but a lot of websites that are similar the sizing was always really bad and really really teeny tiny because it was based sort of towards more Asian sizes who are naturally smaller so if you're like tall or bigger or anything like that it was a bit of a nightmare but yeah everything seems really good at the minute and I got some super cute stuff to show you so I am just going to start pulling stuff out here. I don't know what any of this is so I'm just going to be pulling things out of packets and showing you. Okay so the first thing, the first thing is like a dress and it has sort of like a mesh bit at the top and then like lace along the bust. I hope I got the wrong size. I know I've got stuff a little bit too big in some sizes, but I kind of like a lot of clothes to be baggy anyway, so I'm not too bothered. It also has lace along the sleeves here. I'll just use my face to show that. And yeah, and then again, along the bottom, you've got the same lace. So it's just like a really nice, simple lace dress. It has like a cold shoulder thing, so the shoulders have a cut out and it's just like a really nice sort of like basic little gothy thing and I just thought it was really cute. Oh, okay, so this is like a lace dress. It has like quite a deep V neck if you can see. Let me sort of put it up here for you. There you go. And um, it's like a nice sort of baggy, swooshy, pretty lace dress. Again, just like throw this over like, you know, a little black vest or something and it would make like a super cute sort of summer staple so I'm really excited about this. If anything is like way too big I'm just going to go and get taken in a bit because I wasn't really sure about the sizing plus I have lost a little bit of weight so that's kind of throwing me off as well but it should hopefully be okay and it just like I said it would be so nice for the summer because it's like nice and light and lacy. I do not know how many times I'm going to say lace and lacy throughout this haul so just bear with me. This is, oh this feels really nice, whatever this is. Um, do you know, I'm gonna put a picture because, right, what it is is like a big, huge, baggy, cold shoulder type, like slouchy top. And then it also has like a lace vest that go, like attaches over it. But right now I can't get the lace bit to go up over the t-shirt. So it's like a t-shirt up here and a vest down here, if that makes sense. But I will figure it out whenever I'm not on camera and trying to talk to you guys. Spent way too long on that. <laughs> oh, so this is like a really pretty sort of lace up corsetti dress type thing with these like cool, ooh, like pointed lace, like bell sleeve type. <laughs> this is super gothy. I don't, I don't know. Like there's loads of really good stuff. I'm sorry if there's like m like multiple double chins when I'm doing this, but I'm trying to like pull back away. But yeah, you can kind of get the idea of what this is like and I thought this would be super, super cute. For, again, like a lot of this for me is very much like a summer goth clothes haul because everything's nice and like light and comfy and like it, I really need comfort in the summer. I cannot put up with like really tight restricting clothes whenever I'm baking to death because it's just so much worse. I need like, I need to move. <laughs> this is something in a cute teeny tiny little packet. Oh, these are nice little gloves. Let me see. I thought they were socks and I was like, I don't remember these. Oh, those, oh, those are cute. Look at these. So it's like, they're kind of like elbow length little gloves with this lace panel and a thumb hole. And that is, oh, I'm gonna be using these a lot. That is so, so cute. Look, oh, I might keep that up. Actually, no, because with these sleeves, my jumper sleeves are really tight. So, well, yay. <laughs> oh, silly day. This is a hat. And this was weirdly the most expensive thing of this entire haul. And I did notice like all the clothes on the website were really, really cheap. The most expensive thing mostly seemed to be hats. Hats were like much more expensive than clothes. I don't know why, but let's try to ooh, pop this back into shape. So it's a little battered and bruised from shipping, but let's try to get an idea if my camera will maybe, aha. Look! So it has like netting and feathers and a pretty gem. I don't know which part's the front and which is the back. Hmm, because this feels like a bit much for the front. Oh no, maybe. I don't know. 
Like I said, I kind of need to reshape it and stuff. I don't know if that might be much for the a bit much for the front. Maybe that is the back. I don't know. I will figure it out. But I wanted to try out more hats, and this one was just very fancy, and I couldn't quite resist. <laughs> oh, okay. This are, these are not what I thought they were. So this is like what I thought these were were like quite thin um, leggings. So like little sort of leggings with lace on the bottom, but they're kind of like a. Like, they're a lot thicker, they're not denim. I guess they're kind of the same kind of material that I assume jeggings are made of, if you remember that trend. They're actually, like, very thick, like, so these would definitely be more trousers than, like, because I was going to use them for underskirts, but I feel like they would be a bit more trouserish. But yeah, so they're kind of, like, they look sort of denimish, but they're really stretchy. And then they have, like, lace on the bottom, but only at the front. Not what I thought. Sorry about that, my card filled up, but I got the mystery package open and it's lots and lots of cute little rings, which I'm really happy about because I want like just that sort of looking you know, where you have like loads of stacked rings, especially sort of lower on your fingers and stuff. So I just got loads of different little rings. I'll try to show some of them. So it's roughly this kind of idea. I've got like two little packs full of rings like this and they're just super cute. They're all like silver and it's adorable. Next up, I feel like this might be a swimsuit, but I could be wrong. Ooh. Oh, nope, definitely feels like a swimsuit. Okay, like this. So it is a swimsuit. It has like a little bit of padding in the boobs. I don't know if I can get rid of that or not. Although it's not too bad because I got like a swimsuit once that had like really weird padding in the boobs. It was like, they like they were really solid and they came really far out, but they were like very small. So it was kind of like long boobs and like obviously my boobs didn't fit into this weird shape so it was just awful but this is a lot sort of softer and stuff and the best thing is it has a little skirt which is adorable so hopefully if I'm going swimming this summer this will look cute and I won't look too much like a beach whale or if I do I'll look like a beach whale in a cute little skirt so I mean like glass half full <laughs> wherever this is. oh I know what this is this is quite big I'll definitely have to show pictures and such okay so this is like a nice gray ooh ooh so this is like a nice gray very very long sweatshirt type thing it's like big and baggy and cozy it has a hood and it's kind of like high to low at the bottom if you can see that at all it's huge and hard to show, but um, yeah, it's just, it looks really comfy, especially for days where I don't really want to get ready. I can just kind of throw this on and away I go. So yeah. Next up is this kind of like dusty rose colored, like sort of shimmy, like pretty dress. And I kind of got this because I thought it'd be really nice to like layer under a black dress that's like lower cut and then have this kind of lace at the top, if you know what I mean. And then maybe a bit of the sort of pink color peeping out the bottom. So I just thought this was really different and it just really caught my eye, so I went for that. And then there is just one more thing, apparently. <coughs> Hopefully I've got everything because it came in like multiple packages for some reason, like over the space of a week or two. So it's a little hard to tell if I kept track of everything. Okay, so sorry guys, I forgot to show, well I didn't forget, basically uh, these two things that are actually my favorite things came after I recorded that video. Um, I've been wearing this today and it's covered in glitter, I'm sorry. Uh, but this is one of them. And I will pop a little picture, of course. And also, here is a little clip of me actually wearing it while I was recording some videos today. Uh, you will see those soon. But yeah, so this is one of them. And then the other top is this one here. It's so, so pretty. It has this really lovely lace that kind of comes along like above your bust and then down here and these cute little flared sleeves and it's just like the ooh, <laughs> it's just like the prettiest thing ever and it was so so cheap so that is amazing this is a very strange shape but it's like a cool top with like lace sleeves but the way it is is like the whole side comes down lace and then when you put it on it like drips over I don't know how well it's going to show on camera, but I think it looks really cool. You definitely need to wear a bra or something with this. Well, I mean, like, I guess most people do. I don't. <laughs> uh, so if you're like me, you'll definitely need to wear a bra or, like, something to cover your nips with this because it is a wee bit see-through, as you can see. Um, but, like, a little vest under this would sort that, I think. And Or I could even wear the pink thing under it if I wanted. And, yeah, just, again, like, light, flowy, lacy, nice things for summer is what I'm aiming for. So I am pleased. So, as I say, I believe that was everything. I hope that was everything. 
it seems to be everything. Um, I am impressed. Everything seems really cool. I didn't like pick anything up and feel like it felt like shoddy quality. All of it feels good. And yeah, just I am happy, happy, happy. So if you are a goth on a budget, it is definitely a good idea to check out websites like this because like I said, one of the biggest problems that people have whenever they're trying to find goth clothes is they think they can only buy like goth clothes from goth brands, goth websites, by like, you know, if it has the word goth on it, and that's not the case. You can buy really wonderful, like goth appropriate clothes from just completely normal places, and they work just as well. You just have to style it in your own way. So I hope you liked this. All the information will be in the description box down below. Um, anything that I missed will be down there. Just that's where I put things that I forget to mention and other important things or things I think you guys might like. It's all down there. You just have to click the little see more because a lot of people think it's just like the little bit that you see, which is like a couple of lines, but my description box is super long. So there's lots in there <laughs> for you to go look at. Consider checking me out on Patreon if you haven't already because that, like, that just supports this channel so, so much and I cannot explain how much I appreciate it. And yeah, like, comment and subscribe if I didn't say that already. Tell me what your favorite thing was and I'll see you in the next video. Bye lovelies!